When comparing two numbers, we can use three different symbols to show our comparisons. We can use the greater than symbol, we can use the less than symbol, or we can use the equal sign. If a greater number comes first in a number statement, we use the greater than symbol, like this. If a smaller number comes first in a number statement, we use the less than symbol, like this. And if both of the numbers in our number statement are the same, we use the equal sign, like this. Here is a place value chart. As you can see, we have the ones column, the tens column, and the hundreds column. The further the column is to the left, the greater the value of the column. Here are the numbers 460 and 930. In order to compare these two numbers, we need to look at the highest value column, which is the hundreds column. As we can see, 460 has a four in the hundreds column, and 930 has a nine in the hundreds column. We know that nine is greater than four, and therefore 930 is greater than 460. We can show this using the greater than symbol. 930 is greater than 460. Let's have a look at another example. Here are the numbers 870 and 820. As we can see on our place value chart, both of our numbers have their highest value digit in the hundreds column. However, we can't compare these numbers using the hundreds column, as both of their digits in the hundreds are the same. Therefore, we need to look to the column which has the next highest value, which is the column to the right, the tens column. We can see that the two tens in 820 is less than the seven tens in 870. So therefore, 820 is less than 870. We can use the less than sign to show this. Let's look at one more example, but instead of using a place value chart, we're going to compare the numbers using base 10. Here are the numbers 355 and 357. 355 has three hundreds, five tens, and five ones. 357 has three hundreds, five tens, and seven ones. Looking at the base 10, we can see that both of our numbers have the same amount of hundreds. So therefore, we need to look to the base 10 that has the next highest value, which is the tens. We can see both of our numbers have the same number of tens. So again, we look to the base 10 with the next highest value, which is the ones. 355 has five ones and 357 has seven ones. Therefore, 355 is less than 357. We use the less than sign to show this. Thanks for watching. See you next time.